Well, a warm welcome to you as you join us for this neighbourly clash between England and Wales. It was, of course, one of the most frequently played internationals for a good part of a century, and there was always a very healthy sense of rivalry. Some things have changed since then, but not the interest that is derived when this game comes round once more. There is something special, whatever the sport, when these two nations meet, and that specialness is very evident in the ambience which surrounds us now. And we have in front of us this gloriously imposing arena, absolutely picture-perfect for a game of this nature. And we rise now for the English national anthem. Well, it is, of course, one of the long-standing rivalries that have been forever present on the British Isles. And I wonder what this latest chapter in it will bring. Well, it should be a wonderfully exciting game. Um, I certainly hope that way. And I think that the two teams have been in a, a pretty healthy state from what I've seen of late. The last significant games have been pretty close. And I'm expecting a, a pretty similar outcome with a lot of these players knowing each other so well from their club endeavours. It's hard to see there being a huge difference whichever way this shapes. There's the whistle, and here we go. Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? Gareth Bale, for me, has got to be the, the standout man. Mm -hmm. Renowned for his great pace, he also has a, a crack at shooting range, better than most. And... Goes for goal! Oh, good effort, he got plenty on that. Yeah, the shot was enabled, Peter, due to such smart control and technique. Alan. Mepham, Ampadu. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Jordan Henderson. And it's Grealish. Yeah, he's fouled in there. Henderson. Now can shapes to shoot. Good challenge. He just stood firm. Maguire hoists it forward, cuts it out. Davis drives it forward. Forward it goes. I think that's offside. Yes, it is.
keeper's got good distance on that. Stones with a searching ball. Just brushed off the ball there. It's got through to him. Been levered clear. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Good defending, albeit from an unexpected source. You have to admire a commitment like that because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing. But instead, he looks as if he relishes the chance to uh, to dig in for his team here. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. Tries a shot. Sancho really used his body to clever effect in dropping the shoulder to carry on. And it's Ramsey. Out to the left it goes. He could have been in, just needed a better final ball. Uh, that was just poor decision-making and a weak execution. Has a pop! Oh, that is rather wayward. OK, it's come to nothing, but it's a warning of further threat on the break. Grealish gets it back. Grealish. He'll have a go. A collective sigh of relief from the defence. That's what all good teams do these days. Pressing from the front is highly effective. Bale. And it's played forward. Pickford catches it safely. Alexander Arnold. And it's Ramsey. Attempts to play it through. And it's got through. Cross deflected behind for a corner. Back like that, always appreciated by the crowd. Well, they say that your front lads should be that first line of, um, of stopping the opposition, and I think he's taken it to another level with his desire to get back and, and help everyone out. Has he found his man? Mepham. Davis, Ramsey, and here's Bale. Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. Chilwell, Chilwell gets it forward. And that is going to be the final action of the first half. So now the team has broken through. But certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goals. <laughs> Wales head to the dressing room, not yet having broken through. Tight, cagey game. Now the team any further forward than they were when they started out. Start of the second half. No score in the first half. Who's ready to go for it now? Ramsey. Davis. 
Now it's Ramsey. He's got options out wide. And he's there to clear it. And here's Bale. England have turned to their bench and we're going to have a substitution. And it's been taken short. Mepham. Allen. Big chance! Greenish. With good energy in defence as well. I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team, really, your striker should be the first line of that defence, and, and he's delivering. Davis, that's an untidy challenge, free kick given. Nicely controlled. Gets the chance to cross. Well, there's no sign here of forwards working back. They are staying upfield. They are, Peter, and it gives them a chance to, to break, but it's also causing a, an extra defensive presence to, to prevent that. Good running with the ball, can they build on it? Bale really just wasn't quick enough then. Well, his thinking certainly wasn't. Didn't make use of what I felt were some very good options. Roberts. Roberts. And here's Bale. Bale! He's done very well to get to that. Bale simply didn't do anything wrong. He was thwarted by brilliance. Madison, and here's Kane, plays it back. Grealish! So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Ampadu attempts a clearance. Madison sticks in a foot to win it back. They've been denied a chance to develop any rhythm in the passing. It's Kane! And it's Davis. Going through. Oh, looks like he's been taken out there. Well, that looks a foul. Yeah, referee's given it. Just the talking to, I think. Yes, it is. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. Surely! Whipped in. 
Wales merit full marks for their attitude and application in trying to win this. It means an awful lot, obviously. Chilwell. Chilwell goes looking. It has, has a hit! Cleared away. England showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. Tries to get it forward quickly. Maguire goes back to base. Tries to locate someone up front. He's made sure that that won't get through. Over to the left. Here it comes. And he's got the ball glued to his feet. Hoists it forward. Well, both sides might have to settle for a draw here, although there's still a chance for one last fling. Keeper sends it forward. Done very well to intervene. Sancho plays it out to the flank. You wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late, late steal here. Allen. Lepham. And that's that. Well, a frustrating game for attackers on either side. They hardly had a sniff. Defence is broadly in charge, and it has finished goalless. So there it is. What struck you most about that? Yeah, I think the first thing to say is that the draw was about the right result. It had everything you want in a clash of this nature, the commitment, the passion, great ebb and flow to the game, and I think everybody can go home with a, a little bit of satisfaction from this. And all that remains for me is to thank Jim Beglin. That's it from us tonight. A very good evening to one and all.